I look like a hot fucking mess. I really do. So I wanted to film a video today. This is a plate, okay? Yes, it's a plate. I wanted to have some fun, all right? And I wanted to be an artist today. So I wanted to do a full face of makeup with artist brushes. So that's gonna be tricky. I went to Walmart and I picked up this All Media Artist Pack. Um, it says for acrylic, watercolor, oil, and all media brushes, I guess, you guys. So this is how it looks like this. Okay, so I'm so excited because, you guys, I just wanted to play with makeup today. I wanted to see what is up. So let's go ahead and take out all of the brushes. Okay, <laughs> all right, bitch. Let me go ahead and take the other ones out. Oh, I see you. I see you highlighting fan, all right. I really wanna have fun today. I just wanna play with makeup, guys. And you guys, these are all the brushes that came in it. Um, this was about like four to five dollars for all of these brushes. So I am mad at it, guys. So let's go ahead and jump right in and let's start this video. Let me put those down. I'm gonna start off with this brush right here. Look at this, guys. Look at this brush. Okay, okay. And this is an angled brush. Maybe this will work for the brows, guys. Let's put this to the side. I want to go in with my chocolate mousse um, brow pomade from Morphe, you guys. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, we are going to be using this for the brows without any spoolie. So I'm going to go ahead and really just dip right in, guys. I'm not going to use any spoolie. I do not want to cheat. So let me go ahead and uh-oh. Okay, let me just use a spoolie to brush my brows. I won't use it to, you know, like blend the product, but I will use it just to brush my brows and make sure they're in place. So let me go ahead and see how this works, you guys. Okay. Jesus, be with me. Okay, great. No, okay, maybe, but concealer can help, okay? Concealer can help. My God, I'm so annoyed that I cannot like even brush with a spoolie. Okay, you guys, I really, 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 really miss a spoolie now, but I also like, I'm finding a new appreciation for the spoolies, guys, because, oh Lord. Okay, I need more darkness on the, like up here. So, okay, it doesn't look too bad. I think the outer part looks horrendous. But other than that, I don't think it looks too bad, okay? I mean, it's whatever. Just like that, guys. So now, let's go in with concealer, guys. So, I'm gonna go in with my, oh, let's just do, let's do Huda Beauty. So I'm gonna go in with my Huda Beauty. Uh-oh, it's dirty my huda i'm ghetto you guys I, you guys i'm going ghetto okay i didn't go buy a little pan you know with the, to look cute like an artist so i'm getting one of my platos my plates okay and i'm going to take my huda beauty um concealer this one is in the shade creme brulee i believe no wait granola granola all right guys so this is in the shade granola 
I'm gonna go ahead and put some concealer right here. Oh yes. So I'm gonna go ahead and put some concealer right there. And then now I'm gonna go ahead and pick up a artist brush. And we're gonna try to sculpt these bitches out. You know, I need some help. Jesus, take the wheel and help me, please. Let me see what you said. Okay, let me see this one. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this flat little brush, you guys. And then I'm gonna go into the concealer, tap into it just a little bit. And then we're gonna sculpt the brows. So let's see if this can do it, guys. So let me see. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, wow, okay. Ready. <laughs> so then let's go on top of the brow as well, guys. Let me go right here. I'm not gonna even take any more product. I'm just gonna use whatever I have left on it. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, you guys. So just like that, I think it did. I did a good job the best of my ability you guys how does this look be honest i don't think i'm doing so horrible but i don't like them <laughs> so you guys i'm gonna go ahead and pick some other of the concealer and put that all over the eyelid for my eyeshadow base so that's what i really am gonna use just gonna use the same brush and then we'll go in and try to find another brush that will probably be better for eyeshadow. But you see a lot of the brushes are just like they're um flat, so I don't even know how the hell we're gonna do this shit. Like But that's why it's a challenge. Okay. All right, guys, so now let me go in with, let me see what options I got. Okay, maybe I can use this one to really get like right here, like, ooh, a cut crease. Okay, no, maybe not. Okay, this one looks a little fluffy. So I'm gonna take this fluffy one first and let's go in with, Morphe or ColourPop? Let's go in with ColourPop. I love Sara E's um, collab. I want to go ahead and take this one right here. Wild Soul. Let's go ahead and put this into the crease. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. No, 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 no. So I'm really going to dig into here, you guys, just like, like that. And then I'm just gonna go on it and just oh, and apply it like a flat, like like flat, flat wise. Okay. Not too sh not too bad, you guys. Not too bad. Just going up here as well. Just so that way I can have like a nice transition color. So I'm just laying this color all the way down first. Let's go in with Misbehave, which is this really like um, reddish color. You guys, that's how the brush looks right now. Oh, yeah, I am so nervous, guys, for this shade. Okay, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put it on the outer corner. Okay. I'm gonna wing it out. Okay, what the fuck am I doing, Jenna? What am I doing? Okay, let me go on the lid, I guess. 
Okay, all right, all right, artist. You guys, I'm just packing this on. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I really don't know, you guys. What look I'm going for. Maybe I should take this off. Huh? Not go so out. <laughs> okay, so I'm roughing up this brush and it's like actually getting a little bit bigger. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in with this brush and I'm gonna start blending, guys. Hopefully this works. Yes, much better. See, I love this side. I just don't like this side. Maybe I should go in the brow as well, guys, just to give it a little extra oomph, you know? All right, so just like that, I'm gonna leave it like that. I'm just gonna pack a little bit more of the color on. All right, guys, I know it's looking like a mess. I know. I know. So now what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to go in with... Hmm, hmm. Let's try to do a cut crease, you guys. Should we try to attempt a cut crease? I think so. So I'm going to go ahead and do a half cut crease. I'm going to go ahead and grab some more on my, from my plate, some of that concealer. All right, guys, so just like that, they are cut. It is cut, you guys. Cut crease. Now, I would love to go in with, let me see this. Shirt. Let me so I'm gonna go in with this shade right here. This one is shade Muse. And I'm gonna go ahead and pack that on right here in the front, right? Oh, oh, no, no, not that one. Muse. I'm gonna go ahead and put that right here. This is like with like a little brush like this. I don't know how to explain it. Let's go in with the palette again. I just applied that gold shade. Now I'm gonna take this red shade right here, you guys. Oh, yes. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place it on the outer corner and just shake it upwards. Oh, yeah. So let's go ahead and put this on the outer corner first. 
Now I'm gonna put that in the inner corner as well with this as well. Oh yeah. Okay, you guys, I look so, so messy. Like, I really look so horribly messy. So what I'm gonna do, guys, is I'm gonna take a little paper towel. I'm gonna wet it with my setting spray right here. And I am going to clean up because it ain't cute to look like this. Oh, wow. this one this is like a ginormous flat brush guys I'm gonna go ahead and put my dr. Brandt pores no more and I'm gonna go ahead and just put it like right here on the apples oh my god it is rough oh lord it is rough and scratchy come on priming I really gotta get that nose too so let's go ahead and use our NARS foundation. This one is in the shade Syracuse. I don't know if this still fits me, guys. I haven't used this foundation in a long time. This one is the Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation in the shade Syracuse. So let's go ahead and put some onto my brush. It looks like it's gonna be my shade. And you guys, I'm so used to a beauty blender, so Let's see how this shit works. Now, okay, so now I like to cut my beard out. Okay, that's okay for now. Okay, well, it's pretty. It's so pretty. I haven't used it in forever, you guys. This was like my favorite, favorite, favorite foundation. But let me go ahead and use my my plato. I'm going to go ahead and take, take it over here on this side. Two, three. Right here, that's my foundation. Let's go ahead and do the other side. You guys, I'm just so not used to using like a brush like this. I know back in when makeup be started to become popular, everyone was using like that, you know, that flat foundation brush. Oh no, I can't believe it. And I'm, I have to use like a little bit more product than I normally would, but I'm finding out. This is a little light for me, maybe. I don't know. When I look at the footage, I'll find out. You guys and I love this foundation. I really, really like. Let's go ahead and use our Joway Essential High Coverage Concealer. I'm going to go ahead and put some of this onto my plate as well. I'm going to put it right here. Come on, Jouer. Okay, so that is my concealer for my under eye. That's my concealer. Use, I'm going to go ahead and use the same freaking spatula. And I'm gonna go ahead and take it like right here, go underneath and really start to swipe up. Oh my gosh, you guys. This concealer better help me because it needs to perform and be like a miracle for me because it's not okay. It's not okay.
Okay, you guys, so then I'm gonna just flip it back over to the foundation. Sorry, that's not my mirror. And then I'm gonna start to sweep outwards and really get under here. I guess just like, no, bitch. No, I want to slay with this fucking makeup look. I want to slay with this makeup look. Like, I really want to slay. I don't know if I can. So let's go in with cream contour. I'm going to go ahead and use this shit right here. I'm going to go ahead and put my contour right here. Which is that color which this color is toffee from the born this way concealer and chestnut because toffee is a little too dark chestnuts a little too light so i'm gonna go ahead and mix them on here and make the best cocktail that i can because we need to we need it so let's go ahead and mix this up here you guys it's this cream contour. <laughs> Let's go ahead. Oh, okay, color. Hey, it's my first time trying out this color. I might end up liking it. Alrighty. Let's go and cream. Let's go and cream contour. Right? We might as well try it all, you guys. So let's try and let's go ahead and blend this out. I like the color. Maybe it needs to be a little darker. I don't know. No, actually the color's fine. I think it just needs, it's not opaque over here. That's why. I think that's what it is. Bitch. So let me go ahead and go under here and start to swipe up. Come on, cream contour. And you guys, let's go in with our Huda Beauty powder. We're gonna go ahead and take this powder and we are gonna be setting with this one, okay? So let's just try to set it and forget it. Okay, this is not my That is not my my mirror. All right, guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and blend out all of this creasage. Wow. And we're gonna go in with the powder. Oh, I'll use this big brush since it's a lot bigger. I could get get it done faster. And go under here and just really set. I'm guessing, like, I don't even know. Oh, yeah, come on, fan brush, help me out. too bad now I'm gonna go in with a bronzeador I'm gonna go in with this fan brush I'm gonna go ahead and take where's my bronzer oh I'll take this one this one's the color pop bronzer and afternoon delight I might as well take this one I'm gonna go ahead and bronze bronze up a little bit Up, bro. 
bronze up. Now we need to go into highlighty. Let's go in with this one. This one is from the Maleficent collection with ColourPop. I'm gonna go ahead and use the other side with this fan brush from the the Oh, it's pretty, but too light for me. So let's go in with the darker highlight. Let's go in with the better highlight. So let's go in with this one. This one is the highlight finish in luminous gold number two from Lancome. going with this one this one's probably more my color oh already highlight can fix any bad mistake let's go down the bridge of the nose people let's go on the point the bridge cupid's bow oh yes Wow. This wing with this brush. Hello. Wow, you guys. Like, look at that wing, though. Like, that came from this brush. Let's take our Fenty bronzer, actually. Let's go ahead and take this bronzer. We'll go ahead and swirl this in. And use this as a. Oh, yeah, that's really pretty. Using this as like a little color on the bottom lash line. Oh, it looks actually really pretty, actually, like that. Take a little bit of this red shade again, this misbehave, or whatever it's called. I'm gonna go ahead and put that right there. Wow. And then for the highlight or whatever you wanna call it, I'm gonna take Lucido again. I'm gonna put that in the inner corner of the eye, just like right there. Wow. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the Fenty, no, not Fenty, the Huda Beauty Liquid Lipstick and Friend, Girlfriend. We'll take that one, and I'm going to go ahead and put this on the back of my spatula again. Oh, yes. And we're going to pick this up. And we will line our lips. Sheer, which I don't mind because my, my look is already so much. I put these lashes on 
Last thing I need to do is I need to use this I Love Sada EX Color Pop in the shade Atole. I'm gonna go ahead and put this on my plate as well. This is a lip gloss. This is a lip gloss, guys, that has like pink and gold in it. So I wanna use this one. And let's see what happens. Oh, it's a pretty gloss. Pretty, I actually love this combination now. This is the finished look. Um, okay. So let's go ahead and talk about some shit. You guys, I actually don't think that it came out ugly. I mean, to be honest, this, okay, you guys, so I don't think it came out really ugly. I know there are some imperfections, like my fucking bushy caterpillar brows. Um, maybe the a little bit of the blending of the shadows. Um, this liner is like winged and like curved. This one is just straight. <laughs> um, complexion wise, as in like the foundation, I think it looks pretty good. But I will say that I don't like the streaky streakiness of it. But that's a given because these are artist brushes, guys. These are not regular, you know, makeup brushes. Like these ones over here, that they're not these, okay? So... I am not even mad at it, you guys. I really am not. I really can't be mad at, mad at it. All right, guys, so that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys really liked this. I just wanted to have some fun. Oh, I can't get over these brows, though. I really can't get over the brows. So, but anyway, guys, so these are the brushes that I did use. Um, you guys can always get these ones at Walmart. I mean, who's really gonna go buy these and try their makeup out with it I doubt anybody will unless you guys have a YouTube channel as well but these are really pretty and really good quality um, I will say for painting so right after this you guys I'm gonna give I'm gonna wash these and give it to my kids so that way they can play with them and stuff okay, so this is my full face using artist brushes you guys and oh my god this is my palette this is my ghetto ghetto palette that I made myself. It's from my kitchen. It's my plate. <laughs> so, let me know down in the co comments down below. Let me know how you think I did. Um, I didn't put lower lash mascara or anything in the waterline just because I can't. With my artist brushes, I don't want to damage my eyes. I don't want nothing to happen, you guys. So, and I couldn't use an eyelash curler, so that's why you can see my funky, you know, eyelashes coming through. Other than that, guys. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please give me a fat thumbs up. Please, uh, you know, hit this video right here. Watch it, please. And hold up. Subscribe. Thank subscribe you. to my video, you guys. Please, uh, if, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. I really, really appreciate it, guys. But if you guys love this video using my artist brushes, like I said, just give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next one.